Hey there! I'm going to be doing the 90s tag and I've tried to get a little bit 90s with my attire and my scrunchie which you can't really see in the shot. I was born in 1989. The younger years of my childhood were definitely spent in the 90s. There are 18 questions. Question 1. What was your favorite TV show? My favorite TV show was Mr. Dress Up. And I actually have it on DVD. He obviously dressed up for stories, did a lot of art stuff, some drawing things, there were some puppets thrown in there. Number 2. What was your favorite toy? My favorite toy was definitely I say definitely a lot, was Polly Pockets. The only Polly Pockets that I have left are the big mansion, which is the best. I don't have any more of those little ones. Unfortunately, I gave those away, but this one is pretty awesome and I have it here to show you right now. It basically just kind of opens up like so. And her bedroom and stuff is in there. Workout room. Apparently that's, uh, I think, a tanning bed in there too. I'm not sure uh, how good that is for your health, Polly Pocket. The kitchen area, the little seeds, I don't know if you can see them, but they can move. And here's one of the little Polly Pockets. Oh, and of course, you know, powder room. Oh, and can't forget the pool. Number three. What was your favorite commercial? Now, I was thinking about this and I was like, I don't remember any commercials from the 90s, but the only one that I can think of that I even sing today is Hungry Hungry Hippos. Hungry Hungry Hippos. It was for the Hungry Hungry Hippos game and it was like this and you had to like catch the most out of all of them. Number four, In Sync or Backstreet Boys? I'm gonna have to say I was loving Backstreet Boys more than In Sync. This one's one of their CDs, black and blue. Number five, what was your weirdest fashion trend? I'm gonna show you a picture of a fashion trend that I was like, eh, what am I wearing? Now, I don't necessarily know if this was a trend or rather just bad taste and I'm a kid and I don't really care about that kind of thing. It would definitely have to be the socks with the sandals and those lovely leggings worn as pants. <laughs> Number six, what was your favorite collectibles? I collected a few things like marbles, pogs, and beanie babies, but the one that I got most into was definitely Beanie Babies. Number seven, what was your favorite Beanie Baby? And that was the Peace Bear. I love his tie-dye, his little peace sign there. He was born February 1st, 1996. All races, all colors under the sun. Join hands together and have some fun. Dance to the music, rock and roll is the sound. Symbols of peace and love abound. Number eight, how many Tamagotchis did you go through? I don't think I ever had any official Tamagotchis, but I had a couple Little Mermaid themed ones and the Tamagotchi or little animal that I had was a guppy, supposed to be kind of like flounder, I think. I got two, maybe three of them. I think there's an app for Tamagotchis now on the iPhone and Android, so that's kind of cool. Number nine. What was your favorite game console and game? The earliest game console that we had was the N64, and I had the little clear purple controller, which we still have. My favorite one was the Mario Kart 64. Number 10, what was your favorite Disney Channel original movie? Mine was for sure Halloween Town. I was gonna say Xenon, but I don't think that movie was from the 90s. I think it was in the 2000s, the millennia. <laughs> Number 11. What was your favorite music artist? I might say Britney Spears, but I'd probably go more for a band. Like my previous answer, it would be Backstreet Boys. Number 12. What was your favorite Nick Jr. show? Now, I don't think we ever had Nick Jr. I think that's more of an American thing, but some of those shows were also shown here on just a different channel. My favorite Nick Jr. show was Eureka's Castle. They were basically puppets, and the theme song was kind of like Eureka's Castle. Number 13. What was your favorite candy? Mine was Warheads. Now those were so sour. I think they still sell them. Number 14. What was your favorite game? I.e. board game, school game. My favorite board game was called Let's Go Shopping. The shopping game that's bags of fun. <laughs> Looks something like this. So I think there were things in the store and you used money and I just liked the whole idea of kind of being a grown-up, having my shopping list, going and getting my stuff using money, fake money, but that was fun. Number 15. What was your favorite McDonald's Happy Meal toy? I think my favorite was the Barbie one. Some of them had all plastic and some of them had the real hair. I think I got the one with the real hair and it had like a golden heart behind her. But my other favorite one that was a little bit cooler, more interactive was the Inspector Gadget one. And you you get different pieces of him and then if you got all of them you put them together and each one kind of did something funky like Inspector Gadget does. Number 16. What was your favorite book? 
My favorite book that I believe I read on my own was probably 1999 when I was 10 and I could read this type of book was The Castle in the Attic. The kid goes into this world and I just overall remember enjoying this book. Number 17. What was your favorite clothing store? Mine was Northern Getaway and this was from grade 3 probably on to grade 6 or 7 but mostly grade 3, 4, 5. Number 18. What would you watch when you came home from school? I remember watching Pepper Ann when I came home from school. She had orangey red hair, it was pretty frizzy and a ponytail. You probably remember it most by the theme song, I'll try to sing it. Kinda went something like, Pepper Ann, Pepper Ann, she's too cool for seventh grade. No one's cool as Ann, Pepper Ann. She's her own biggest fan, Pepper Ann, bum 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 bum. And I think a little bit of Roseanne somewhere in there. All right, that concludes the 90s tag. I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you want to do this tag, I definitely tag you. I also specifically tag Annie Inspired, Nikki White, and Phil Hollywood. So feel free to do the tag and let me know when you do it. You can link it down below in the comments so other people can go see it too. One little note, I think I mentioned this in another video, but when I reach 200 subscribers, I'm gonna read a bit of my diary from probably the 90s, but probably more early 2000s. If you wanna get me there, definitely hit subscribe. If you wanna see other things going on in my life, I've got my Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, that kind of thing linked below so you can find follow me and say hi. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked and subscribe if you want to see more of the videos that I make. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good day. Bye. Qua bleh. From the... Oh, I feel like I sneeze. <laughs> nope. Okay. Cat. Oh, wow. I can't do it. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm gonna add this in the video. Number... <laughs> I can't do that many. Number... <laughs> Skinnamarinky dinky ding, skinnamarinky do. I love you.